Welcome to our Leading with the Heart celebration. We thank all of those who have nominated Leading with the Heart candidates. We also want to congratulate our Leading with the Heart nominees for this year. Leading with the Heart is important. The reason it's important is because it shows the care and compassion that these nominees have for the students at their schools. Because of their care and compassion for their students, our school communities and our school district are better. At this time, I would like to introduce our Johnston County School Board Chairman, Chairman Todd Sutton. On behalf of the Johnston County Board of Education, we are so thankful for what our employees do each and every day. Now you're about to see a short video of our recipients of how they interact on a daily basis with our students and the staff. Enjoy. Stephanie Ford, Archer Lodge Middle. We chose Stephanie Ford for Leading with the Heart Award because she always goes above and beyond and for the love and care that she has for her kids. Ms. Ford is such an integral part of the EC team here at ALMS. She is loving, caring, compassionate towards all of her students and the staff on a daily basis. She's a great asset to our team and we love you, Ms. Ford. Ms. Ford is a dedicated teacher here at Archer's Lodge Middle School. She um, plays an important role in the students and staffs here. She's caring, kind, and loving. Mrs. Ford is a wonderful, wonderful mentor. My first year here at Archer Lodge would not have been possible if she was not a part of my life at this school. She has made my first four months here um, a wonderful, wonderful first year, and I don't think I could have done it without her. Ms. Ford, you're the best teacher ever. You do so much to help us every day. Ms. Ford, you're the best teacher ever because of all the things you do for us. We love you. Ms. Ford is a great teacher who always helps us with any problems we have. Ms. Ford can always talk to me and is always there for me to help you. <laughs> Mrs. Ford was born for this job. She's an advocate for her students and puts their needs first. Ms. Ford leads with the heart by leading by example. Ms. Ford, thank you isn't enough for your dedication to our students at our school. You truly lead with the heart and for that, the Lodge is a better place. Jennifer Green, Benson Elementary. Mrs. Green comes in each and every day, ready to receive her preschool students with a great big smile. She takes them by the hand as they enter into the classroom and leads them throughout their day. Our students are comfortable and relaxed as they learn new skills in Mrs. Green's preschool classroom. We are just delighted to have Mrs. Green at our school. She is definitely one of a kind. Lindsay Yarborough, Benson Middle. She always strives to keep a smile on everyone's face. She's always here for us when we need her. She spreads positivity everywhere she goes. We love you, Miss Yarborough. positivity, energy, and amazing heart bring so much joy to the student staff and families of Benson Middle, whatever it takes. Susan Vance, Clayton High. Going to me. First of all, let's pick a letter. What letter do we want to use? What letter? Mm -hmm. See? All right. She works tirelessly for her students, serving as an exceptional children's teacher to assist students in reaching their academic, behavioral, and social goals. Susan is a great teammate, constantly extending herself to help others throughout the building. She has a giving heart, often taking her own money and resources and willfully sharing them with others to offer them assistance while advocating for students outside of the school day or even post-graduation. Susan's enthusiasm is contagious. Her laugh and humor are refreshing, and her words and smile are reassuring to both her students and her peers. Teresa once said, it's not about how much you do, 
but how much love you put into what you do that counts. Susan expresses that love, teaching and helping young people be the very best that they can be. Susan has always taught from the heart, but it's even more inspiring to witness her leading her peers, our students, and our school from the heart. Susan Vance ex exemplifies what it means to be a common all-in with her commitment to help all students and staff be successful. And it is why she is deserving to be recognized as the Leading with the Heart re Award recipient. Rebecca Mercer, Clayton Middle. But that is part of me assessing your performance is if you can find the C on your own. But if you get it wrong, I'll fix it for you. Yes. <laughs> Student performance. This is how Rebecca Mercer leads with her heart. We love you, Ms. Mercer! Brianna Hines, Cleveland Elementary. Bree Hines is Cleveland Elementary's Leading with the Heart recipient. Her kind and caring personality immediately put her colleagues, parents, and children at ease. Children in our school always feel at ease going to her with any problems that they need help with. She always responds to them with a listening ear and great advice. The work she does to improve social and emotional well-being for our children helps them to be ready to learn when they enter the classroom. She truly understands the importance of relationships, not only with our children, but with parents and staff. We are very fortunate to have Bree at Cleveland Elementary. Francis Johnson, Cleveland High. Our Leading with the Heart recipient is Ms. Francis Johnson, one of our teacher assistants. She has a beautiful heart and pours everything she has and is into this school, her students, as well as the staff of Cleveland High School. Ms. Johnson genuinely cares about each and every individual that she comes into contact with. She takes time to get to know all of her students and to ensure that they are well cared for, attentive in their classes, and that they are held accountable for their actions in and out of school. Ms. Johnson is an amazing individual and role model. She is a dedicated leader in our school community, and she has a positive attitude and positive words to share with everyone. Our school could not ask for someone who has more heart and soul than Ms. Frances Johnson. She deserves this recognition more than anyone I can think of. Kristen Bolton. Cleveland Middle. Cleveland Middle School is proud to name Miss Bolton as our Leading with the Heart recipient this school year. As our EC department chair and curriculum coach, she has impacted so many students, parents, families, and staff members. Congratulations, Miss Bolton, for being the best teacher ever and getting an award. Congratulations, Miss Bolton. You deserve Miss Bolton. Thanks for having me. Too late. Thanks for keeping me awake last year not making me an idiot in math class. All I can say about Ms. Bolton is that she's a saint. I adore her, I appreciate her, she's awesome. All right. Thank you Bolton for always being our leader and guiding us through everything when we need it. And being our third musketeer with the crazy curly hair. We love you and this award is definitely much deserved. Hey Ms. Hey, Bolton, Ms. Bolton. Hey. Well, congratulations, Good you God. deserve it. Adrian P. Walker, Cooper Academy. The Cooper Academy family is proud to honor Adrian Walker as our Leading with the Heart recipient for the 2019-20 school year. Mrs. Walker has a special gift of touching the hearts and minds of her students at the school. She has an exceptional ability to establish positive working relationships with students, colleagues, and families. Our school community respects her work ethic and teaching practices in the classroom. Mrs. Walker's desire for student success is contagious. She works diligently to prepare, teach, and collaborate with staff to ensure student learning. She's a valuable team player in our Cooper Academy family, and most importantly, she's made a positive impact on our school community. We are honored to recognize Adrienne Walker as our heart of the team, and she certainly brings out the best in all of us. But don't just listen to me, listen to our students. We love you, Miss Walker! Ashley Holloman, Corinth Holders High. 
Corn Tellers High School is excited to announce that our Leading with a Heart recipient is Ashley Holloman. She takes a lot of time to get to know her students and she's an FFA advisor, ag teacher. She comes up here on the weekends and helps out with the barn, with the sheep and the goats and everything else. She takes a lot of time to get to know these kids and really develops those relationships with them and goes out of her way to get to know them and, and progress them through their high school career and a successful future. Ms. Holloman is a great candidate for Leading with the Heart because she helped me in the classroom and helped others succeed too. She also takes the time and effort to really form a personal connection with her students so she can get to know them better. She's personally like a mother figure to me. Um, I agree. She's basically my adopted mother at this point. I spend so much time with her. She really helps you to be successful in everything you do, no matter if it's FFA related or just um, life and furthering your education. Um, she really takes the extra mile to help each and every one of her kids. We love you, Miss Holloman. Christy Boswell, Corinth Holders Elementary. Hi, I'm Chris Kennedy, principal of Corinth Holders Elementary School, and our Leading with the Heart nominee for 2020 is Christy Boswell. Ms. Boswell does everything around our school. She is a TA in first grade, but she also works before school and after school care. She's some of the first folks that we see every day with a bright, smiling face, and she's one of the last folks that some of our students see every day with that same bright, smiling face. She does so many things around here and is the absolute epitome of someone who has a huge heart. Our school loves Christy Boswell. She's sunshine personified. She's always willing to help and she always has a smile on her face. She cares about every student at this school. Thank you for helping us reading better, Miss Boswell. We just want to let you know that you are so kind and how you're so nice and um, you're so special. Congratulations, Miss Boswell! Helping Miss Molly with our reading groups. You're the best after school care teacher ever. Congratulations, Miss Boswell. We love you. Misty Zimmerman, Dixon Row Elementary. Mrs. Zimmerman is full of energy, but also extremely patient and understanding. She greets all challenges with a positive, get things done attitude always looking for success. She is willing to be a part of any team that places students at the forefront. I love Miss Zimmerman. Love is at the core of Misty Zimmerman's teaching. She appreciates and deeply cares for each and every one of her students. She has a huge impact not only on her students, but also with our parents and the staff at Dixon Road Elementary. There is not a more deserving recipient of the Leading with the Heart recognition than Misty Zimmerman. Debbie Hines, East Clayton Elementary. I love Miss Hines because um, she's really nice and she helps us and she helps me do our paper. Miss Hines is kind. She loves us all and she helps us. Miss Hines is the best teacher. She's the best teacher because she makes us get better at learning. Miss um, Hines was a very nice teacher and she used to help us a lot to learn new stuff. Miss Hines was very, a very helpful teacher. She taught us what we needed to know and she was very helpful to us. So we love her. Madison Simerson, Four Oaks Elementary. Madison is a fantastic person to work with. She is so positive and kind always. You never see her um, frowning. You never see her in a bad mood. She is also so detail-oriented. You should see her IEPs. They're incredible. And um, same with her IEP report card. She knows those kids like the back of her hand. Madison is a cheerleader for her students and for the teachers she works with. Um, she is first one to praise the students and acknowledge what they've done and how great it is in their growth. And if you're a teacher who works with her and you're having a rough day, um, she is very quick to help you to see all the good you've done for the students and to help them. Madison is supportive of her students and us as teachers to figure out ways to help support them. Um, she goes above and beyond for each one of them. We love, we love you, Madison. Madison. Thank, Thank you, Madison. You. The kids love you, Madison. Misty Barrett, Four Oaks Middle. 
Hello, my name is Anthony Whitaker, principal at Froze Middle School, and I'm here to present Miss Misty Bear as our 2020 Leading with the Heart candidate. This is a woman that is full of passion for students, the community, and she shows it day after day when she's here at Fort Oaks Middle School. We have a few cardinals that are going to speak about her kindness and her love that she shares throughout the school day. She's better, she is my teacher, she teaches good, she teaches well. She's always doing the best, and um, there's nothing you can, you can ask her that she can't help you do. If she can't do it, she'll find somebody who can be of help. Um, She's, she's just wonderful. Miss Barrett, we can't thank you enough for all that you do for Four Oaks Middle School. The students, the staff, the community, you are what makes us the Four Oaks Middle School and so great. We thank you for everything you do and congratulations. Amber Martinez, Glendale Kinley Elementary. Amber always goes above and beyond for students. She is always finding new ways to meet their needs and assist in the learning process. She is so helpful to her peers as well. You can always count on her help. She has the biggest heart and she deserves to be recognized for her hard work and dedication to education. Congratulations, Mrs. Martinez. Randy Parker, Innovation Academy at South Campus. Mr. Parker is the epitome of greatness. He does not wait for someone to ask for help, instead recognizing when there is a need and extending his assistance. Mr. Parker is Mr. Fix-It, football fan, family man, loving, sincere, generous, caring, understanding, father figure, knowledgeable, genuine. He is a model leader of learning, teammate, and the heart of our pioneer team. DeAndra Tart. Johnson County Career and Technical Leadership Academy. CTLA, we're so excited that you are the one who has been chosen as our recipient for Leading with the Heart. So at this time, I'm going to get out of the way so that you can hear from some of your colleagues as well as some students who absolutely love you. We love you, Mr. Tart! <laughs> My nickname for Tart is Big Heart Tart. Oh, 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 my God, that's so you cute. love our students, you love the staff, you are genuine, and you care about each one of us, and you always go the extra mile. Way to go, Big Heart Tart! <laughs> Tanya Taylor, Johnston County Early College Academy. I put down a few things that I want to read about her, but we don't have that much time, so I let the kids and one of her co-workers speak because I can't read all of this. Uh, thank you, Ms. Taylor, for doing what you do for your students. You are so passionate about your job and about your students. You always make sure that they have the tools that they need to succeed. Thank you. Ms. Taylor is a perfect candidate for the Leading with Heart Award because she always has warm greetings and smiling around ECA. She brings a lot of interesting ideas and a lot of comfort to ECA. Ms. Taylor is a perfect candidate with Leading with the Heart because she always finds a day to make everyone's a way to make everyone's day here at ECA brighter. She always acknowledges people in the hallway and just makes spreads positivity throughout the school. Hi Tanya! Congratulations, we are so happy that you're a part of ECA. Congratulations on Leading with the Heart. Kara Lilly, McGee's Crossroads Elementary. We are so very proud of our very own Kara Lilly for being nominated as McGee's Crossroads Elementary's Leading with the Heart recipient. This honor couldn't be given to anyone more deserving. I just don't think that there's any way you could even start to describe Kara Lilly. But we're going to try. We've created an acronym to describe Miss Lily. L stands for lead. Miss Lily truly leads with her heart. I stands for involved. Over the years, she has involved not only with her classroom, but her grade level team as lead and sit representative. She has been our M class and I station trainer and has been in charge of career day and our school's relay for life team. 
L stands for love. Everything she does is with love and compassion. L stands for loyal. Her loyalty to the school and community is constantly evident. I is for innovative. She is always looking for ways to improve her teaching. E is for extra. Miss Lily goes the extra mile to help her students and colleagues. Congratulations, Kara Lily. We love you. Karen Spivey, McGee's Crossroads Middle. I'm a student of Miss Spivey, and she is the best teacher because she's really fun, and she um, she explains things very well. And I was also I'm also in the FFA, and she's a great advisor because she helps people improve. Um, Miss Spivey is a great teacher because she um, talks to us in a very good way and explains the curriculum very well. She also gives us plenty of definitions and stuff to learn, and we usually come out with a positive influence from our class. You learn a whole lot of stuff about agriculture and stuff of that topic. And she does it in a fun way to where we like it and we do projects that are based on the curriculum. Miss Spivey's a really good teacher because she's really nice and she teaches you a lot about everything. Miss Spivey's a great teacher because she makes things fun when we do it in class. Mrs. Spivey, thanks a million for your compassion, empathy, positivity, relationship building, and inspiration here at McGee's Crossroads Middle School. Glenna Wozniak, Middle School. Ms. Wozniak teaches self-contained students. She works with these students on making good choices in social and emotional situations. She has taken kindness and acceptance to a new level. Along with her students, she's initiated a school-wide kindness challenge to promote and acknowledge acts of kindness to others. Through the kindness challenge, students all over the school are making more conscious choices. They are being intentional in their actions to show kindness to others. Ms. Wozniak is a great example for leading with the heart. She goes above and beyond always, not only for her students in her class, but anyone here at Meadow School. Ms. Wozniak is special to me because she's a great teacher and she has a great heart. Ms. Wozniak is special because she helps me with my work and she'll be there for me when I'm down. Ms. Wozniak, she's the best, but she got big heart. Ms. Wozniak has a very nurturing spirit and is motivated to help her students as well as all the students at our school. We love her. She always has a kind word to say and a word of praise telling everyone how awesome they are. Her heart for others is reflected in her smile, her actions, and her love for children. She inspires us all to be the best we can be because she is one who leads with a heart. Penny S. Metcalf, Micro Elementary. Mrs. Penny, as she goes by around here, is our early care and aftercare director. She's a clutch substitute who works in that capacity nearly every single day. Uh, she also is instrumental in setting up the micro elementary clothing and supply closet. She uh, helps organize those donations and making sure they get to the kids that need them. She volunteers in our library and she volunteers as a science Olympiad coach. I don't know how she finds all the time to do this, but believe me, she does. She has a huge heart. She is the epitome of a team player. She has a positive attitude and she leads with enthusiasm. Thank you, Miss Penny, for leading with the heart at Micro Elementary. David Anderson, North Johnson High. Hardworking, dependable, and outgoing are words used to describe Coach Anderson. Legendary Coach K writes in his book, Leading with the Heart, in order to be a winner, you have to look for ways of getting things done and not for a reason why things can't be done. And Coach Anderson exemplifies this. Coach Anderson wears many hats. He's our student advocate, a girls and boys tennis coach, announcer at basketball games, structured lunch coordinator, and is instrumental in every aspect of our absentee process. His dedication to keeping up with students that need extra support goes above and beyond his call of duty. You can give him a name of a student and he is quick to say where the student is, what is going on, and when the student will return. He begins each day welcoming students with a smile and a word of motivation. Coach Anderson is quick to make students and staff laugh daily. You never walk by his office when there's not a student in there looking for advice or just to talk. Parents and community members appreciate his wealth of knowledge 
and do not hesitate to reach out to him when needed. Coach Anderson is a great credit to North Johnston High School, a true Panther, and always shows that Panther pride. Garfield Baker, North Johnston Middle. North Johnston Middle School proudly honors Garfield Baker as our Leading with the Heart recipient. Mr. Baker is an outstanding teacher who has a special gift for finding talent in his students. He encourages students to work hard and do their best every day. His ability to establish positive relationships with students, staff, and families is just one of the reasons he was chosen as this year's Leading with the Heart recipient. Mr. Baker is described as someone who is a great role model, a team player, who is passionate about teaching and learning, who is enthusiastic, who is helpful, who is a coach, a mentor, but most of all, someone who leads with his heart. North Johnston Middle School students also agree that Mr. Baker is a great choice for this recognition. He's devoted to helping students. He's very selfless. He's got a big heart for kids. He is very influential. He is a great leader. Congratulations, Mr. Baker. Stephanie Casey, Pine Level Elementary. The simplest way to sum up Pine Level Elementary's Leading with the Heart recipient would be, everybody should have one. Stephanie Casey is a selfless, gentle, consistent presence in our school. Her warm and nurturing demeanor speaks security and support to her students, as well as her co-workers. Her willing heart is an asset to our school and community, never complaining and always ready to do whatever is asked. She is an example of professionalism and excellence in all that she does. Pine Level Elementary is blessed to have Mrs. Stephanie Casey as one of our own, and as I said, Everybody should have one. Christina Thompson, Polenta Elementary. Christina Thompson is an awesome member of the Polenta family. She is always doing whatever it takes to ensure that the students and teachers get what they need to be successful. Whether it be a technology need or a student academic need, she is there to help with a positive outlook and a smile. She works tirelessly every day to make sure that Polenta is a great place to be. We want to take this opportunity to say thank you so much for all that you do every day. You are truly an example of leading with the heart. Yes. Yay! Brenda Brinkley, Powhatan Elementary. Hey, Miss Brenda Brinkley, we appreciate everything you do for us every day and representing Powhatan for Leading with the Heart. We just want to say you are our rock here at Powhatan, and we appreciate everything you do, not only for the students, but our staff and parents. Um, you're the backbone to help us go through and do what we have to do every day. We just want to say thank you. Thank you. Bridget Winstead, Princeton Elementary. At Princeton Elementary School, we're so excited to announce our 1920 Leading with the Heart winner, Bridget Winstead. And while I can tell you all kinds of wonderful things about Miss Winstead, I thought it would be cool for you to hear it from the people that she impacts the most every day, her students. Yeah. Winner! Baby! Amazing! Nice. Um, available. <coughs> Super! Oh, man! Wonder. We appreciate Miss Winstead. She is the perfect one for this award. She's like the Energizer Buddy. She's always on the go and keeping that battery charged. She's always looking and finding things to keep the students focused and engaged in daily activities. We are very proud to work with Ms. Wednesday. She is an amazing woman. Though the year has had some challenges, she embraced it with a smile and never missed a beat. She definitely leads with her heart. We love you, Ms. Wednesday. Logan 
Wheeler, Princeton Middle High. Hey, this is Jarvis Ellis, principal here at Princeton Middle High School. And I'm here with Ms. Wheeler's class. And we're here to celebrate her being the recipient this year of the Leading with the Heart recognition. Ms. Wheeler goes above and beyond what she needs to do each day for our students. We're extremely proud of her. And we hope that she continues to lead with the heart, along with the rest of our faculty and staff here at Princeton Middle High School. Class, are y'all ready? On three. Yeah. One, two, three. We I love, love you, Ms. Wheeler. <laughs> Pamela B. Sanders, Riverdale Elementary. Pam wants every student at RDE to be their best self. She sees the possibility and promise within each and every student, and she strives to help them reach their goals. As she works with many students that have encountered roadblocks in reaching their potential, she is never satisfied knowing only what happened. She digs in to find the why. She encourages students to be reflective. She is firm but kind. She has high expectations, and she guides students to meet those expectations each and every day. She is dependable and all the students and staff at RDE know that they can count on her without fail. She not only supports our students, but she is the queen of the copier, making hundreds of copies each and every day for our teachers and traveling at a moment's notice to do repairs on stubborn hallway copiers. She is the diabetic care manager for numerous students and assists them in keeping track of their insulin and sugar intake. We love Ms. Sanders and we appreciate the love that she puts into her work each and every day. She is so deserving of this honor and we feel so blessed to have her as a Riverdale racer and our 2019-2020 Leading with the Heart recipient. Christine Mitchell, Riverwood Elementary. Ms. Mitchell is devoted to her students and their families and her colleagues as well. She has a heart of gold. Ms. Mitchell helps me when, when I'm struggling with my math problems. Ms. Mitchell is amazing because she says that she cares. Ms. Mitchell is prepared because when fourth grade and fifth grade come, she has work for us ready. Ms. Mitchell is always helpful because when I don't understand something in math, she makes me understand it way better. I refer Ms. Mitchell as selfless because whenever she approaches us or families or teachers, she always says, what can I do for you or how can I help you? My word for Ms. Mitchell is dedicated. She is not only dedicated to all of her wonderful students, she is dedicated to our staff and to the parents that she serves. She is a servant leader who is dedicated to this school and this district. We, we love you, Ms. Mitchell. We love you. Lizzie Hobbs, Riverwood Middle. Ms. Hobbs is a Riverwood Middle School leading with a hard winner. When we think of Mrs. Hobbs, we think of someone that is dedicated, hardworking, and always has a positive attitude. She is loved by both students and staff and always has an encouraging word to share with everyone. Congratulations to Mrs. Hobbs. We're very proud of you and glad that you're a Riverwood Raven. Shamika Williams, Selma Elementary. Thank you for being so caring, Ms. Williams. Thank you for helping me for staying out of trouble. Ms. Williams has heart. What do you think about Ms. Williams? Well, very nice woman. Very nice assistant principal, too. Uh, and if I would describe her, she would be like the best one I would met. She, Because one time I met her, and we've talked for a few minutes, and then I went back to class, but I would feel like I would talk to her like a lot of times. She's like the best woman. Michael Lowry, Selma Middle. Here at Selma Middle, we love to celebrate that our opportunities are greater than our barriers. And one such individual came to mind as our school was voting for our Leading with the Heart candidate. Coach Lurie's influence goes way beyond the classroom as he served as head boys soccer coach and head girls soccer coach in which our boys team has already won the conference championship. Like any great coach, Mr. Lurie also knows that academics must be in place in order to be a successful athlete. He has dedicated his time to daily tutoring for students to make sure that they have the grades that they need to be successful student athletes. Sarah Anderson, Smithfield Middle. Organized. Intelligent. Friendly. 
is an outstanding teacher. Influential. Encouraging. Passionate. Bold. Hardworking. Inspirational. Passionate. On behalf of Smithfield Middle School students and staff, we would love to congratulate Ms. Sarah Anderson. Ms. Anderson is passionate in her devotion to education and to the AVID program, and we admire all that she does for our school on a daily basis. Waldina Martinez, Smithfield Selma High. Our leading with the heart representative is Ms. Waldina Martinez. Liderazgo con el corazón se lo ha ganado Waldina Martinez. Waldina Martinez una persona perseverante, una persona que ha trabajado duro, una persona que siempre tiene una sonrisa en cada momento de su actividad escolar y fuera de la escuela. Es una persona también que trabaja bien duro para que todo esté limpio en la escuela como consejera y ayudante de esta escuela. Ella es posiblemente una de nuestras mejores empleadas. Miss Waldina does a wonderful job around our building all the time. If we call, she's always there. She's dependable and loyal. She smiles to a fault, even in a wheelchair when she got hurt once. She smiled. Miss Waldina is the very best we have at Triple S, and we are proud to honor her today as leading with the heart. Amy Cox, South Johnson High. Carolina Packers presents Real Educators of Genius. Real Educators of Genius. Today we salute you, Miss Amy Cox, CDC Career Expert. CDC Career Expert. You come to work every day with a smile, not complaining when your principal asks you to serve duty after duty after duty during lunch. Duty after duty. Thank you for leading yet another CTE PLC about the ACP and the DMV. You test, you guide, you are the holder of a career knowledge. Sweet, sweet, sweet knowledge. You lead with the heart as it bumps and thumps, sending happy, happy feels and rhythm to everyone around. Leading with the heart, thump, 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 thump. So bun up another bright red, dye filled, bright leaf hot dog, you leader of the pack. We salute you. Miss Amy Cox, CDC expert. Carolina Packers, Smithfield, North Carolina. Amy, your tireless efforts and love for our school does not go unnoticed. You are a rock star for our CTE department. We truly appreciate all that you do for our school. Know that you are loved and appreciated by all. And that is why we are glad to present you with the 2020 Leading with the Heart Award for South Johnston High School. Joel McKay, South Smithfield Elementary. Ms. McKay build, builds relationship with all students in the school. He is a great role model for the young men in the building. Mr. McKay goes above and beyond to help at breakfast duty in the morning and bus duty in the afternoon. During the school day, he works hard educating his students in his classroom. Mr. McKay leads with his heart to make everyone's day brighter and better. Thank you, Mr. McKay. We love you. Alicia Hewitt. Swift Creek Middle. When you lead with your heart, you touch the lives of everyone around you. Alicia Hewitt is a prime example of someone here at Swift Creek Middle School that puts our school, students, and staff first. She is organized, caring, and always willing to help. I'm here with some of her students. Let's hear what they have to say about how fantastic she is. She's always happy no matter what. She has a bubbly spirit and she's always enthusiastic. She's very nice, always helps us when we need it. She trusts us to make good decisions. She always stays calm, nice, and caring. She's really funny, she's open-minded, and she's just a great person to be around. If she has a problem with you, she handles it in a calm way. She takes time with her students to help them step by step. Heather Wolf, West Clayton Elementary. Miss Wolf Heather is brilliantly talented and she's full of compassion and joy. Heather really just takes the time to build the relationships, not only with her students, but with her peers and her coworkers. 
She means everything she says. She pulls everything from her heart, it's true. I think that every kid and student that works with her and every teacher that works with her comes off a better person. And I think our school and this world is a better place because of Heather. Mrs. Wolf is always kind and loving, especially with those students who face daily challenges. She's dedicated to seeking the best for all of her students and working tirelessly to ensure their emotional well-being so they might open their minds to the task at hand, learning. Mrs. Wolf is empathetic to their families and the real life struggles parents face each day and recognize life impacts children in ways out of their control and tries to counterbalance those effects in an effort to make learning environments and even opportunity for everyone. She's also a wonderful mentor and teammate. What I especially admire about Mrs. Wolf is that she is able to maintain a high standard of teaching even when she is furthering her own education, seeing a child off to college, and keeping up with the busy life of her high school son. Congratulations, Mrs. Wolf. We love you. We love you, Mrs. Wolf! Fran Clark, West Johnston High. Every teacher in here knows that there's that one person at their school that they can laugh with, cry with, count on. Frances Clark is my person at West Johnston High School. I'm so glad that she won the Leading with the Heart Award because she definitely deserves it. The way that she looks whenever her kids in DECA and FBLA succeed, win, or accomplish something is so awesome to see. She left me 12 years ago, but even when she left, we still collaborated. And there's no one at West Johnson High School that deserves this award more than Frances Clark. Ms. Clark, you've helped me a lot. I remember struggling through role plays and presentations, and you've been there for me. Thank you. Fran is a very special person. We've worked together for many, many years. Very passionate about what she does. She is very trustworthy, she's full of integrity. She reaches out to the kids and the kids love her. She's done things for teachers all across the states, for the county teachers. She's just an awesome person all the way around and we are so lucky to have her. One of the reasons I love Miss Clark is she really cares about her students in and out of the classroom. For like for me, she's come to some of my games and tryouts and just makes me feel valued. Fran Clark, thank you for sharing your heart. But more than that, you model and encourage us to do the same through your work at West Johnston High School. That is why you are our Leading with the Heart for 2020. Congratulations, Ms. Clark! Danielle Pleasant, West Smithfield Elementary. Danielle Pleasant is an amazing addition to the West Smithfield Elementary School family as our social worker. She has a great ability to work with our Smithfield and greater community. She continually strives to improve our school culture. She gives 110% to all aspects of her profession to meet the needs of our students. Ms. Pleasant is a true example of a champion of hearts of those around her. Ms. Pleasant is committed to serving others. She is very sincere, kind and passionate. She always has a smile on her face. West Smithfield Elementary is blessed to have her serve our school community every day. When looking for a model of leading with the heart, one looks at talent, trust, and a winning attitude with regards to the goals set out by the school. Coach K says, it takes courage not only to make a decision but to live with those decisions afterward. Danielle Pleasant is a true example of leading with the heart. Ms. Pleasant cares about the whole school community. Ms. Pleasant is an example of a champion of heart to those around her. That is why West Smithfield Elementary is proud to have her as our 2019-2020 recipient of Leading with the Heart. Michelle Oliver, Westview Elementary. As we're looking for a candidate for our Leading with the Heart nomination, I, I think this person should be an integral part of our staff. I think we need someone that's dependable. Someone who's a team player. Michelle, Michelle Oliver. Oliver. I 
me, she is here every day and she has a smile on her face every single day. And you know, I don't think I've ever seen her have a bad day. She's a leader amongst her teachers. Um, she provides support each and every day to teachers and to her students. She is a wonderful person in our staff and we are so very proud of her and all of her accomplishments. Congratulations, Ms. Oliver. Congratulations. Congratulations. You deserve it. Ms. Oliver is a good teacher and she helped me with math a lot. So. Miss um, Oliver is a good teacher. She um, uh, likes this school and she's, um, she likes every um, his and she um, everybody likes her because she reads a lot of books to them and those stuff. She was the best reading teacher. She learned how to teach me to read so good. Michelle Carmelo, Wilson's Mills Elementary. Thank you so much, Shelly, for being the yin to my yang and helping me balance that classroom. You are an awesome co-teacher and a wonderful person to be around. I love your energy and your spirit, and thank you again for just being in my life and being the best co-teacher possible. Thank you so much for, for everything you do for us, and thank you for making me smile when I pass that door. You always make my day. Shelly embodies the characteristics of leading with the heart. She is an advocate for students that she sees from the time she meets them in the morning until the time that she leaves for dismissal. Shelly Carmelo exhibits a positive approach to her job every single day. Her joyful attitude and commitment to student relationships as well as academic progress are worthy of this recognition as she truly leads with the heart. Congratulations. Bonita Road, Curriculum, Instruction, and Accountability. Bonita, help us with IEPs. This ECATS is driving us crazy. She Louise. Bonita reports, checks, plans, and tells us to meet but nothing ever seems complete. Would you, could you change the form? This crazy ECATS is becoming the norm. Another change, a brand new box. Benita keeps us from losing our rocks. Teams would not meet here or there. Teams would not meet anywhere. Not in a room, not in a hall. Our sweet Benita does it all. Sign here, date that, mark this, check that. Benita is the teacher's advocate. Meow. You do not like ECATS? You say, try it again, try it again, and then you may. Say, I almost like these IEPs. Why not write 6003? We will practice day and night until Benita says it's right. Congratulations, Benita. We love you. Lisa Denning, Equity, Information, and Student Services. Lisa Denning is a school nurse serving Cleveland Elementary and Cleveland Middle. However, it's not just a job for her, it's her passion. Being able to serve students from pre-K through eighth grade have enabled her to develop trusting and mentoring relationships as she cares for their health needs. Lisa's quick wit and enthusiasm for her schools and their staff have also developed or resulted in many lifelong friendships. Lisa's a great nurse and she's a great friend and a great person. Lisa Denning is so deserving of the Leading with the Heart Award. She is always caring for her students and her families, and it's really just an honor to be able to work with her. Hello, we're the school counselors at Cleveland Middle School, and we are so honored that Lisa Denning earned this award. I can think of no one more deserving than her. She is always on it. She is very helpful. She's thorough, and she is a great asset to our school. So congratulations, Lisa. Congratulations, Lisa. You have a great heart. Cynthia Dance, Human Resources and Financial Services. For the Human Resources and Finance Services team, I'm so honored to recognize Cynthia Dance, our Leading with the Heart recipient. Cynthia has been with our school district for almost 10 years. During that time, she's gained much experience at the school level and even at the central level. In her current role, 
She is usually the first person who interacts with our applicants and our new employees and she provides such a warm and friendly interaction to those individuals and we're blessed to have her serving in that capacity. She is well respected, well thought of, always lends a hand to others when needed. Her influence is not only known in our school system, but even throughout um, and outside of our school system. In fact, I have enlisted the help of some celebrities to help congratulate Mrs. Dance. Congratulations. Wow. I say congratulations. I want to congratulate you on an unbelievable career. You did it! Congratulations! Congratulations! Once again, Cynthia, congratulations. Thanks so much for what you do each and every day. Don't, 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 don't. Susan Topoli, Operation and Communication. Susan Topoli is our 2020 Leading with the Heart awardee. S is for sincere. U is for unique. S is for smart. A is for amazing. And N is for nutrition, nutrition champion. champion. Congratulations, Susan. We're so happy. You are committed, you are um, caring, you are helpful, and the passion and the pride that you put into your work is felt by everyone around. We are so blessed that you're a part of School Nutrition. We love you, and congratulations on being the 2020 Leading with the Heart awardee. You deserve it. Sylvia Taylor, Superintendent's Office. David Pierce here, Area Assistant Superintendent this year's Leading with the Heart recipient is Miss Celia Taylor for Administrative Services. Okay, first, first of all, you need to make it straight. You got it crooked <laughs> and wipe them even. Yeah, we don't want it. Yes, even no. to side. Yes, sir, that one. Yes, sir. Okay. I just want to thank Miss Sylvia for always taking care of us. We love you. We appreciate everything Miss Sylvia does for uh, our department. Thank you, Miss Sylvia. You are simply the best. Love you. Miss Sylvia, thank you for everything you do. We know your job is very, very tough and looking after each and every one of us. We appreciate it more than you know and your smile is contagious. Thank you. We are so thankful for all of those who were nominated in our recipients tonight. And we are so grateful for the part that you play on our team. Congratulations. <laughs>